Hey, welcome to the Solid Face Professional Training. Remember to subscribe and click the notification bell to receive our alerts for our weekly training videos. We'll continue our work with the mechanical lathe, and in this video, we'll model its backrests. We'll start with the backrest with threaded holes, and we'll use the same modeling to draw the other one with simple holes. As usual, open a new part. We're going to work with the XY plane. Using the multiple lines, we'll start by adding 5 on the tip, 110 is the height, and a width of 15. We'll go down with a measure of 78, and we'll reach the origin of the angled part. To draw it, take the line to the origin point, like this. Now we'll habilitate the extrude command and add its thickness, which will be 15. Moving on, we'll start the sketch of the inner holes of the part. Habilitate the arc circle, and with the assistance of the relative point, we'll draw two circles centered on the x-axis. We can input 5 as the diameter. On the y-axis, the superior hole will have a distance of 13, and the inferior, 44. Now we'll save the file as we'll use it again later. So go to File, select Save As, and save it. We're adding the threaded holes now, so habilitate the hole command, keeping the simple option. As they're through holes, we'll activate that option. To add the thread, we'll habilitate the Creation option, and we'll use the ISO standard, selecting the thread M10X1. Then select the origin and the finishing face, as well as its center. After that, we can finish the operation. The last thing to do to this part is changing its material to carbon steel, and we'll move on to the second backrest. Please open the file we saved before, the one without holes. Selecting hole, we'll add a new hole to the bottom a simple through hole with a diameter of 11. After that, we'll habilitate hole again, and we'll add the superior hole, activating V-type angle and adding 8 as its diameter and depth. After that, simply change its material to carbon steel, And our backrests are finished. Well, guys, that's it for today. Remember to subscribe and click the notification bell to receive our alerts for our weekly training videos.